Hi, my name is Anton and this video is one video from a series about comparing edge platforms for computer vision. In series of these videos I compare platforms not only in terms of uh, performance but also from the side of convenience and simplicity for development. One video, one platform. Uh, all videos are available on my channel and at the link in the description you can find a final table with different boards and different stats and uh, the article about uh, choosing logic. Today I want to talk with you about ROG chip boards. Right now I have ROG P3A in my hand, uh, but there are a lot of chips from ROG chip and even more board vendors. Uh, each one chip have a lot of vendors uh, and a lot of boards uh, that is using. Uh, here is just part of them. Uh, we already have been used one of these boards three years ago and it was pretty bad memory. Uh, but with the hope that everything becomes better I brought this one and yes it's better. Uh, Usually my uh, story consists from three parts. In the first part I evaluate the board on a number of criteria that I think are important for a computer vision board. On the second part I tell uh, the main way and the different ways to develop on the board, but for this board it's pretty hard and I decided to uh, shoot another video and you can check it on this link or in the description. Uh, and in the third part I will say something that didn't fall in the formal structure of first two parts. How easy to flash? Simple, very simple. But there is one thing. You have to choose the right firmware. Uh, and this will make it work. Uh, check my video about how to develop and the right firmware is Debian. How is it to work? Difficult. Uh, very little documentation. Uh, one part of the documentation is poorly linked to other part. Uh, the board has one manufacturer Radxa, uh, but of course uh, for development you should use ROG chip documentation and uh, it's pretty hard to find corresponding link between these different documentations. Uh, some of documentation is translated into English but not all of it. Uh, but I need to admit that the situation is much better than three years ago. Three years ago it was hard to find uh, English part in documentation. And now it's completely different. Uh, and it's the only board from my reviews so far uh, which has led me to the blue screen of death uh, when trying to export neural network. And it uh, happens continuous time. How conventional is Linux? Mm, Linux built based on open source uh, Linux, but of course it has some internal drivers. I didn't have any problem with uh, installation of different libraries. Community support. In my opinion, it's very weak comparing to like Google Coral or uh, Raspberry Pi. Uh, even the vendor uh, gits is not very popular. Uh, just check the amount of stars. Mm, I have come across a few Chinese forums uh, and articles uh, that talk about this board. Uh, so there is some community, uh, but not much and not everywhere. 
and it's hard to translate everything from Chinese forum correctly. Google Translate sometimes lost its meaning. Let's move to the models. Official model zoo. It's funny. There are uh, there is a reposit repository called models zoo. And there is exactly one model in this repository. It's um, YOLO V5. And it takes a lot of sweet to convert it. Uh, there are, uh, you need to install some patches upon regular YOLO repositorium. Uh, it's pretty funny. Uh, but there are about 10 more examples. Uh, in the repository Arcanine Toolkit. Uh, but not all of them are convertible. I couldn't convert all of them. And uh, not all of them are clearly obtainable. For example, YOLO V5, you need to uh, use this hard way to convert YOLO V5, and it's pretty hard to find uh, this way because it's in different repository. Uh, but at least they tried and uh, they have some model zoo. Unofficial model zoo. There are no models from community. You just need to use official model zoo or convert yourself. And how is it to convert random model? In my opinion, it's pretty difficult. Uh, a lot of things do not convert. Uh, I managed to convert a few models, but as soon as uh, your model become complex, it's not clear how, how to fix it. Uh, for example, to convert YOLO v5, the author uh, used a lot of patches in the official repository. And they didn't explain these patches and uh, it's look like some magic you need to change this 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 and it will work but why uh, they didn't have enough explanation how to make every neural net how to work with every neural network so in my opinion it's very hard to convert random model Easy to debug problem with conversion. Uh, in my opinion, it's hard to debug, uh, especially for the models that lead to blue screen of death, because there is no <laughs> any debugging for. Now let's talk about how good rock chip is for real products. Processor speed. Uh, the rock. P3A processor is quite weak, uh, on the same level like Coral uh, processor, but it's enough for the most task. And don't forget, there are much better uh, performing boards in Rock Chip series like 3399 Pro and some different boards. Mechanical parts and construction. Perfect. There are a lot of vendors, uh, and each one makes slightly different boards. Uh, and they are well designed. A lot of uh, connectors, uh, pretty good uh, heat removal scheme. For example, uh, on my uh, Rock P, uh, even without heat removing, the board is uh, warms on very low level less than different boards. Uh, the boards from Rock P fit into Raspberry Pi standards and uh, they are com compatible with a bunch of uh, uh, peripherals like cameras, like uh, some monitors and so on. It's clearly a five star. Easy to buy. Uh, some boards such as Rock P are easy enough to buy. Uh, you can buy them on 
AliExpress or on Amazon. Uh, but some specialized boards are hard to buy, you need to order them from vendors. Uh, overall, I will give uh, 4 stars. Pins for external connectors. Everything is pretty standard and uh, it, in Rock P 3A it's comparable with uh, Raspberry Pi. But of course there are some boards um, without pins uh, like heavy development. But they doesn't need these pins. Speed test. <laughs> And let's move to the most interesting part, uh, the speed test for computer vision. Uh, and I was pretty surprised. Uh, the vendors uh, of Rock Chip, uh, the Rock Chip, um, promised only 0.8 tops on this board. Uh, for example, coral board have uh, four tops and uh, Hades board have, have five tops. Uh, but the speed is pretty different for different neural networks. Uh, and uh, for some neural networks it's faster than coral and for some neural networks it's pretty comparable with Hades. Uh, and uh, the more important part, uh, with this board you can work not only with int8, but you can use FP16, uh, and uh, there is uh, option with partial quantization, when you can quantize only part of your neural network, and uh, this uh, approach gives you ability uh, to automatically decide which part uh, will be compare, uh, can quantized and which are not. And in my opinion it's excellent. Uh, you can look at full comparison in the document on, or on this table. Uh, in my opinion it's very nice, very nice speed. Uh, so Excellent board. I'll skip the second part of the story because there is separate video that uh, you can find in the description. The third part. Summary and my opinion. In my opinion uh, the most important thing about this board is that it's uh, uh, strikes a very good balance between price and performance. Excellent one. For 35 USD uh, you won't find another board uh, with performance like it. Uh, and taking into account that there are dozens of version of board for different condition, most likely uh, you can implement the board uh, for specific your case in mass production but you have to pay for it. And uh, the payoff comes at the expense of simplicity and stability. Uh, not every neural network will be convertible and conversion are often very long uh, and support is pretty bad in my opinion. Uh, but at the same time the system uh, RKNN and everything around rock chip is developing. Uh, for the last three years the progress is excellent. But of course uh, it's for example Hades board is much better at this time but uh, I see the progress and I hope that uh, it progress will continue, so it will be one of the best boards uh, pretty soon. Thank you for watching, you can find another board uh, in, the, in the description and I hope there will be another board uh, comparison on my channel. Thank you, bye!